My name is CPA Philip Kakai, the chairman of the Institute of Certified Public Accountants of Kenya. And uh, my main role is to, to chair the council of the institute, uh, which is the oversight uh, body of the institute and also um, to ensure that the institute runs well from a global perspective, continental and um, even regionally. And finally, of course, nationally. Uh, yes, we are launching the strategic plan this coming Wednesday and uh, the main, main, main vision of the Institute is to uh, position ISPAC as a leading world-class professional accountancy body which focuses on strengthening the regulatory framework, enhancing member value and of course uh, uh, taking care of uh, our members. The other important one is to ensure financial accountability at both uh, at the Kenyan level and globally and ensuring that our members uh, adhere to the ethical standards and there is transparency and accountability and ensuring that this is achieved both in the public and private sectors of our economy. The role of the Council in driving the strategic plan is um, to provide critical leadership in the implementation of the strategic plan. Being the oversight, the council guides and directs the institute and ensures the plan is aligned to the institute's vision and mission. The, the council is also responsible for governance, maintaining stakeholder relationship and ensuring that key performance indicators are met. The involvement ensures that the goals are both ambitious and achievable. Um, the, 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 the Institute communicates and will communicate the progress of updates to its members and even clients uh, through what we call uh, reporting mechanisms such as the quarterly uh, and annual updates. There is also a mechanism of establishing a monitoring, evaluation and reporting a framework which will uh, include tools like the implementation matrix, progress reporting templates, evaluations at, at mid-term and end-term. This will ensure that members are informed of all milestones and adjustments made during the implementation plan. The regulatory frameworks that we have set um, within the strategic plan will also be achievable within the five-year plan. But more so, we intend to improve member values uh, within, um, within that five-year plan by br bringing on board various value propositions including greater satisfaction by our members and, and growth in membership. A leadership role in uh, advocating for public uh, financial accountability and governance will also be a key issue that I, I foresee in the next uh, five years. And further, a sustainable and financially resilient organization within, within the, uh, the, the professional space, embracing more uh, digital transformation and corporate social responsibility, or what we now call corporate social investment initiatives. I want to take this opportunity to really appreciate all the stakeholders, our members, our clients, our key stakeholders that have participated and played very important role in uh, assisting us develop this five-year strategic plan. And we can only assure them that what has been uh, developed and achieved so far in development of this particular strategic plan we will ensure that the implementation stage is successful. And we thank them and wish them well. Thank you.